Guys, I think this is a sex toy vending machine. What the heck? What up guys, Calvin here and today we're going to be looking at some of the craziest vending machines that does not exist in America. When I say vending machines, you probably think of a coke machine or a like a gumball machine. But these vending machines, they're unique and they're strange and you probably never heard them before. Before I start the video, I just want to say that please don't forget to get this video a thumbs up right now. It only take two seconds. So go down there and get this video a thumbs up. Really, really appreciate it. And let's get started with the show. So the first vending machine we have is a live crab vending machine in China. So basically, you can buy a crab that is alive and it's inside a vending machine and the company promised that if you bought a crab that is dead they will repay you with three alive crab how cool is that but this machine only exists in china next vending machine we have is a lettuce vending machine in japan so basically they are growing lettuce inside a machine using fluorescent light bulb wow that's cool so when you buy this lettuce it can be fresh super fresh because they are grown inside the machine how amazing is japan you guys probably heard this machine before it's called pizza vending machine in europe so basically you order a pizza and they make it fresh inside the box they will spread the sauce put it on the oven heat it for you and come up fresh they are not frozen they are made on the spot I would love to visit Europe and I would love to buy this pizza. If you guys don't know, my favorite food is pizza. So if you guys have some kind of favorite food like pizza or ice cream, leave a comment down below. I would love to know what is your favorite food. Next up, we have banana vending machine in Japan. You can buy bananas in the vending machine. I thought you can only buy Cokes, Sprite or Dark Pepper, like soft drink in the vending machine. I've been living in America like for many, many years. And I've never seen a banana machine before. This is so creative. I guess Japan, they love to eat bananas and it's very hard to find bananas in the store. So Japanese people basically decide to put bananas in a vending machine. It will be so much more convenient than putting bananas inside a store. Next up, we have mashed potatoes vending machine in Singapore. I've been eating mashed potatoes in my school lunch cafeteria like my whole life. I am pretty much tired of these mashed potatoes. In Singapore, they have a mashed potato machine. Whoa! I wonder how it tastes. Is it gonna be like super hot when when you put it in the bowl and then when you put the sauce in it? Is it gonna be cold or hot? Next up, we have French fries vending machine in Australia. Holy crap! I will take French fries over mashed potatoes any day of the week. I love french fries. If you love french fries, get this video a thumbs up. The only thing I wish right now is to have french fries vending machine in America. Who agree with me? If you agree with me, get this video a thumbs up right now. Who would love to have a french fries vending machine in America? I never see any french fries vending machine. All I see is Cokes and chips. I'm tired of these. I want some french fries. One bag of fresh french fries will cost you one to two dollar so it's not that bad it's the cost of a bag of chips next up we have beer and shake vending machine in japan so this is a great way to get drunk go to a vending machine you can buy all the beer you want it's so convenient like yo what if the vending machine is put right beside a school in japan kids will be buying like buying uh, these beers and going going drunk into the school and then taking a test that's not good so this is a hot bread vending machine in germany so basically they put a, a bread that is pre-made and preheated and when someone order the bread they will heat the bread completely well done and when it come out it can be fresh and hot that's a good idea right i would love to get this vending machine and see how the bread tastes next time i think it's the one of the weirdest vending machine ever it's called lobster vending machine it did not say where the lobster vending machine is located but it's interesting just look at it and then you put chorus inside and you try to catch a lobster <laughs> i mean think about it when the claw go down and the lobster sees that claw go down where the lobster move 
it gonna be so hard to catch. Uh, this vending machine is located outside a restaurant. You just put two dollars inside the machine, and you, if you can catch the lobster, you get the lobster for two dollars, and the restaurant will cook the lobster for free. This is like genius marketing. Maybe 100 people put two dollars in there, only one person catch the lobster. Like 100 people, they made 200 dollars. Wow, guys, I think this is a sex toy vending machine. What the heck? You guys are looking at a vent sex toy vending machine. I have blurred a lot of image out because it's not appropriate for YouTube. But yeah, some genius thought it's a good idea to put sex toys inside a vending machine and display it in the public. I mean, what if a 10 year old walk by and she or he asks her mom, what is this? Why is this weird they look why is this weird they look so weird? How will you answer your kid? Oh oh I don't know just just don't don't look at these things. They they are not for you. It gonna be awkward, right? It gonna be very very awkward to put these sex toys into a vending machine. I mean is this even still legal? Is this legal? I guess it's legal since somebody is selling these sex toys vending machines somewhere in the world i don't want to reveal the location because you guys might just order an airplane ticket and visit the vending machine that's not a good idea so yeah this is about the end of the video if you guys liked it please give this video a thumbs up right now and be sure to subscribe to this channel for more updates this is calvin lee and i'll see you guys next video